Okay, right, man here are some more bolts. I was actually incorrect, it's 7,500 for the um, plasma whip. There's also another weapon, I believe it's called the end something storm, whatever it's called, it's the end something storm. I know it's definitely end something, end something something. That's its name, it's a very good name. Yeah, of course, there's some more bolts up here which you want to collect because every little helps. That's the price, lovely. I don't have enough for the plasma whip if I want it, which I do because it's a great weapon, especially when leveled up. Yeah, weapons can go to level um, 10, I believe. No, is it level No, it's level 8. Is it level 8? Is it level 10? No. I don't remember for some reason. episode of Nature's Mysteries, we examine the Florana tree beast. Deep in the dense growth of Florana's Jambu forest lives a mysterious creature. Or maybe he doesn't. It's one of Nature's Mysteries. I've seen him run right through our camping site. He was buck naked, screaming and holding a banana. Or, or maybe it weren't a banana. It could be one of Nature's <laughs> Mysteries. Legend tells. Oh, who do you think that Rita is? Is actually one of the greatest superheroes who ever lived. No. Shamed by his recent past, he is now one of nature's mysteries. Tune in and find out the answers. Yeah. We need you to find this man. The fate of the galaxy may depend on it. Oh, really? Are you sure this is the guy you're looking for, Mr. President? Yeah, he seems like kind of a, you know. Wacko. You may be right, but he's the best chance we've got. I know you boys won't let me down. You can count on us, sir. Yes, you can, sir. You can definitely count on us, sir. I think this is the time to show you the menu. Now, the missions that you are asked for from Florano and all the other different planets you've been to. So, Florano says find a mysterious man. And, um, weapons. As all your weapons, as you can tell, there is a lot. There will be 20 in the game. Gadgets, again, there are a lot. There will be more than 9. There will be 9 in the game. And this is just how you can change your weapon and stuff, which is quite nice. Then there's the items. The different items you can get. There are 10 of them. There's I have not. Then there's the options, which have I got? Did I? Ooh, what was the subtitles on? No subtitles. Shall we put on then? Then there's help, help log, movies and stuff. Then there's the special. There's the cheats, which we don't have any because we have no skill points. We have the skins, which you have a current armor, and if you have um, titanium bolts, you can trade them in for different um, skins, which I'll probably end up wearing all at least once. Um, then there's the skill points, how to get them all and stuff, which is quite nice. Then there's the cinematics, the movies and stuff, and that's pretty much it. Right. Okay, sorry, just stop for a second. Right, if you go in here, you'll see weapons. There's um, ammo there and two weapons. Oh, as much as I like the plasma whip, I want to save up for the N60 Storm. Mainly because I love that a lot more. Whilst the plasma whip is good, the N60 Storm is almost as good. Your controller can be configured um, with multiple button maps. 
including a map the one thing I do love about this game more than any other Ratchet game is Annihilation Nation I mean I love the I love the battle arena stuff on the first from the second game but Annihilation Nation just stepped up the bar the one thing I do miss is the motorbike races motorbike races oh well this times two multiplier for all your bolts get these quickly get as much as you can times two and it's bloody worth it this is how we're probably if lucky gonna get the N64 we are probably able to get it with this as you can see there's a lot of stuff there so I'm imagining we'll have enough and I'm right we have enough and now we're just gonna go back to the N60 storm because it's so worth it it's just unbelievable how good that is because it's just awesome so yeah we can now get the N60 storm which is just awesome I love that weapon it's great Ah, N60 Storm is mine! Max out ammo, don't have many bolts, but you don't need it, so it's okay. Yeah, if you can afford it, which, if you do everything that I've done, you should be able to afford it. Let's show you what it can do. Oh, it just shoots and kills. That's what it does. You can strafe by holding L2 and R2. Uh, oh, 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 Eva, which I'm going to run for that one's bad. I just got pearled and died. Help it, use the N60 Storm now to level that up a bit. Because we want to give that some time to get some leveling up. Because we want to do some upgrades as well. You don't want, you don't want just to just um, upgrade one weapon in a time. You want to upgrade two if you can help it. It just doesn't help, but oh well. Die! Thank you! Loving it. I like I like doing guides. It's, it's more I, I, I'm in for more, but I'm also funny. Funny to you. To perform a high jump, I just did it. R1 oh no, I didn't. X. You can do that, but you don't need to do a high jump because I'm awesome. Now there was only one set. I thought other people would come out of it. You can get some votes in these things. Yeah, um, there was only one skill point, and it's in the path of death, which is. A bit hard, actually. It's, it's no easier than other stuff, so I may have to read it. I may have to come back here just to get that skill point. It's fairly challenging. There are two Titanic bolts and a trophy for that and a trophy here in this place. The, the Titanium bolts are really easy to find, and the trophy is as easy you to find as well. Actually, jumping on say it that? Because the trophy is pretty hard, actually. Top. Never played it before, I suppose. Can you see the trophy? How is it you um, zoom in? It's not that. That's the map. Maybe we'll show that. This is where you're heading and stuff. It's quite cool. Um, not that. There it is. Oh, inverted camera. Can you see that shiny thing? That's the trophy. How do you get it? Eh, you figure it out. Oh, no, wait, that's my job. Never mind, I'll do it for you then. See, you've almost got enough to buy this already. Ah, nice. I believe it's down here, and I should be right. I'm right. Gold bolt and mundo. No. Why am I saying gold bolt? It's a titanium bolt. I know this. I know it's a titanium bolt, because it's... I've played this so many times. Why do I keep... I don't know why sometimes the bottom... The, some of the bottoms don't go up, break, and some do... I don't really understand why, but they just don't... Oh, I thought it would lock onto it. Not something there, though. Die. I believe that you fight two of these at the same time later on. But I don't remember if that's true or not. Oh, that was close. Well, he's dead. Ah, a new feature to this. It's a good idea. However, I'm not going to use it. I don't know. Should I use it or should I? Oh, screw it. Just use Inferno it. Inferno mode. Inferno mode. Your armor and wrench attack has Your been awesome is increased what it means. for a limited time. Yeah, for a limited time you can do this and kill everyone pretty much. I would rather use my weapon, however, though. It depends. Now that you know what this does, it depends on what you want out of it. Because I'd rather upgrade my weapon on really jump low on health. Jump, then press I'm actually dying, which is quite embarrassing. I'm actually sick. Oh, I will put... Oh, 
Okay, I'm fine, don't worry. Right, I'll be seeing you in the next part.